Okay, hi, this is Pete, and what I want to do is look at sharing a document. Now, here I've got a document in front of me that I've just been creating inside of uh, Google Docs. And if I want to share that document, then it's quite easy to do so. Now, for example, what I want to do is I've created a shopping list for when I get, uh, once I finish this session, I'm going to go shopping. So here I've got my shopping list, spuds, celery, peppers, tomatoes, uh, cucumber, sweet, cabbage, onions and carrots. So that's what I'm going to go and hit the shops to get. However, what I want to do is to be able to share this with other people. So if they've got any ideas of other stuff that ought to be on there, then we can actually, actually add it onto the list. So what I can do is I go up onto the share button and here it tells me all the people I'm currently sharing it with. And at the moment I'm sharing it with nobody. So I'm going to share it with another one of my email addresses. So there's my email, there's another one of my email addresses. So I'm going to share it with that one. And here I've got the options of what that person can do. So I can say they can edit it, they can comment it, or they can view. So here I can add a note. So just off to the shops. Um, and then I can send that message off to the other person, which indeed is me, to be able to go and see if they want to add anything to that list. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move across into a different browser. Uh, and here I am signed into Google Drive on a different browser. And here I can go and see documents that have been shared with me. So here I've got sharing a document at the top there. And that's been shared with me. So if I click onto that and double click to open it, then here I have got that document shared with me. So here I can sort of go down here and I can have a look at what's actually on this list. Uh, yeah, I can go and see recent edits. And as you can see, I've put my cursor next to uh, next to my shopping list here. So I've got next to spuds, um, carrots. Let's go underneath here because um, I think we need some sauce. Uh, fish. And some chicken. So let's move across back to the other document and see what's happening on there. So I've gone back to my other document and as you can see I can see that there's my cursor from my other account and there I can see what's actually being added into this account by the other guy. So here I could go in and I could say I could highlight that um, and then I can go and say uh, I could put that into bold. There we go. So again, I can move back into my other document and that is now in bold. So again, I can work between myself in seeing what's actually happening. Up at the top here, can you see how this uh, account will allow me to see who else is actually in the document at the moment? Um, and I can actually show a chat. So I can actually chat to the other person whilst we're working on this document. This again is magical stuff. You can just imagine two people collaborating on a document and having a quick uh, chat while they're doing it. Yeah. What do you want chicken for? And then press return. And now if I come across here into the other one, I've got this message here that says, Pete Reed has said, what do you want chicken for? And I could respond in any manner that I want. So again, we can actually use this system in a variety of ways. It is a great tool. So, okay, I hope that helps and I shall look forward to talking to you later. Bye.